From visitmysmokies.com, it's the Funcast. I'm your Smoky Mountain meteorologist, Paul Poteet, with the dog days of summer. Yes, I've got some hot numbers to show you in my seven-day forecast in just a few moments. We're also in the back-to-school days of summer, at least uh, some places heading back now, and you'll notice fewer families that you're competing with if you're visiting the area over the next few weeks. Uh, There is something new with the mask policy in the Smokies at the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. There was an update made just a few days ago, and they are now requiring you to wear a mask again if you enter any building in the national park, regardless of whether or not you've gotten a vaccination. That particular decision, though, applies to the national park buildings only at this time. Indoor and outdoor fun continues at Dollywood, and it's now open from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Say hi to the chicken lady for us. The rides are still rolling. The shows are still going. The lines do let up some again in August. There's a little less competition with the return of those school students. Dollywood is closed this week on Tuesday and Thursday. Splash Country is open from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. It's closed on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday of this week. And with the temperatures that I have in my forecast, you're going to need every one of those 35 refreshing acres next door to Dollywood's theme park. Celebrity concerts return this week to Country Tonight in Pigeon Forge. Coming up. This week, the four-part harmonies and classic hits of the Oak Ridge Boys. The Oaks will perform four decades' worth of songs on a Friday night show at 8 o'clock. And if you love music, the Gatlinburg Songwriters Festival is right up your alley. And it's right on our calendar, August 19th. You can see that. And information on the Hot Air Balloon Festival and the Jeep Invasion later on this month by going to the all-new redesigned visitmysmokies.com. You click on Play, and then you click on Calendar of Events, and you're all set. And I'll finish with a fun fact. Did you know there are more than 100 big waterfalls in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park? And, uh... I got some water falling in my seven-day forecast, as you see here. It starts with small chances of showers and storms on Monday afternoon. You can certainly go ahead and make your plans Monday still. Just keep an eye to the sky. Same story Tuesday, maybe a little better chance in the afternoon. And then at any point during the day, we've got several days where we're going to have some scattered showers and storms. Maybe not an all-day rain out, but certainly you'll have to be ready for some rain and for some sweat, I suppose, too, if you're going to be outside with highs each day in the upper 80s to around 90. Of course, we have plenty of cool places you can escape to inside when you come visit mysmokies.com.